Okay, I'll try this again. My name is Doug Powell. I've been a targeted individual for over 23 years. Um, 1999 and 2000. I first started hearing voices, but it's not me being mentally or anything. This is technology being hit against me. For one, if I was mentally ill, after a doctor gave me Zoloft, which he never should have gave me in the first place, within three days I was in jail, the voices never would have stopped. And they did. About two weeks after I was in jail, the voices stopped, but they didn't stop completely. They they just went down in volume. Uh, they did warn me that if they ever came back, I, I, I don't know what they meant by that, except for now they have been back. They've been back since November 2020. I didn't do anything back. I know most of it's political because I have issues most of the time to wear a mask. And from an audio report of mine, they bother Trump people and they're an unknown pedophile group involved within it. Uh, they, they input thoughts into my mind, especially when I'm dreaming. They try to scare me by grabbing me in my dream, try to give me a heart attack. Uh, like I said, 1999 to 2000 was the first bout. I went to jail for seven months out of a nine month sentence. I got out of jail, and like I said, the, the uh, stuff had went down, went down quite a bit. Just really bad tinnitus. And then since that point, I've, uh, I tried to get my life back and paid off my fines, did my restitution and everything, did my probation. And then for about five years, I, I was a, a tech support person. When you called on the phone, I was the one that would help you try to get back online. Uh, and then because of my past, my job found that out and they fired me, although before they hired me, I had two applications, one that said no and one that said yes on the felony. 2005, I got married and been living a normal life or as much of a normal life as I could from that point on. Then again, like I said, in about 2020, I believe, because I won't wear a mask, or didn't wear a mask, and I voted for Trump, these people hit me again with their voice to skull, and ever since then, this has been getting louder and louder and louder, although I don't think they can get any louder than what it is now, but I do have to wear earplugs. I usually put these in throughout the night. I have to wear a beating cap that's lined with silver. I wear this cap once in a, almost every day. And I put these magnets around my head and my ears to try to keep some of the energy. Right now I'm just sitting there, my legs are vibrating and they hurt. Have had these criminals vibrate my ears so bad or make them hurt, zap them like electricity or make the bones within my my head hurt. I don't know, I hear voices exactly like you say, think of like schizophrenia. I hear it in my left ear, I hear it around my cochlea. I think that's what I read as I hit your cochlea and then it bypasses your ear, eardrum and stuff, but it hits your cochlea and it sends the signal up to your brain to interpret it the signal and then you can hear it. Some of the things I researched and the reason I think some of this is louder than it is, I, I found some uh, un 
doing? On the FCC website that they're using like cordless or wireless speakers. And then cell phone. Uh, microwaves hit your head so much to the point where you can start hearing their stuff that that government is sending to you. I've had neighbors fucking I've had neighbors stand outside and say, Grandfather to me. At that point, it made me mad. But uh, I didn't, you know, I was so surprised and shocked by it. I didn't do or say nothing. Since then, I've devoted my life to try to hunt these gang stalkers down and, and find evidence. Uh, I record, maybe not every day, but I do record, I'm going to use this pen camera to record, make video movies and or audio, uh, again, I am a member of Targeted Justice, I am also a member or donated member to uh, ICATOR, that's I-C-A-T-O-R, Targeted Justice is suing the FBI and the De Department of Justice. I think they should go after the CAA. I think they should go after the De Department of Defense and uh, a whole lot more other people because there's a whole lot of, there's NASA, NSA, and our local government and our local cops, they're all in on it. The Sheriff's Department, the, the local cops, uh, they run the back end of it because when you call them up, they'll just tell you, uh, you're not, nothing's happening and they won't investigate. I called our local sheriff's department one day and the stupid guy came out and the first thing out of his mouth was oh and you didn't touch them because on an audio recording I have you can hear two kids say do it at the same time and I told him that and he said oh you didn't touch them if he's not a gang stalker then I don't know who it would be uh, I've had people refuse to give me gas when I'm at the gas station and I rub their lips saying you're a baby raper. I am not a baby raper. I will never be a baby raper. I never have been and I never will be. That's a lie, that's slander. And I've been hurt by their slander. I've been hurt by their signal and I've been hurt by your lies and your and their slander. So I hope Targeted Justice, you can use this video in a court of law, and I hope I cater will hold the criminals accountable. I do believe we win. We will win. I believe in God. Uh, Isaiah 54 says, no weapon formed against us will prosper. I don't care how sophisticated you are, how artificial intelligent you are. Oh yeah, and using your artificial intelligence, you will be just destroyed. I will not take the mark of the beast. I do not worship you. I will not bow down to you. I am an individual. God made me an individual, and I have the right to be an individual. You do not have the right to do this to me. You don't have the right to do this to anybody. Anyways. Again, my name is Doug Powell. I'm 456 of age. I've been a targeted individual, and I hate that word, for at least 23 years. I've probably been a targeted individual for a lot longer than that. But uh, anyways, I hope anybody that knows anything about gang stalking and gang stalkers, go to tar targetedjustice.com. And don't uh, and and donate the 19 bucks a month. Go to iCater and donate at least 10 or 15, 20 bucks a month that you can. Get up to the uh, I think it's 60 bucks for the membership. And then I think it's 120 or 100.